A struggling metro school district is looking at more budget cuts as the district once again makes an appeal to voters for an injection of cash. Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey live in Shakopee tonight. Courtney, Shakopee residents rejected an operating levy this past election. Well, now the district says more cuts are on the horizon. Yeah, Randy, this district has already made seven and a half million dollars in cuts for this current school year and the next school year. They're the only district that operates without a voter improved operating levy. And they say if that continues, more cuts are inevitable. Either we need an infusion of, you know, permanent ongoing operating revenue, and the only viable place to get that's an operating levy, which needs to be approved by the voters. Or we'll be making, you know, a little over $5 million in budget cuts again for the 23-24 school year. The school board held a public forum tonight where they laid out the financial realities of the district and answered questions. After an operating levy failed to pass last November, the district cut more than 50 teaching positions, resulting in an increase in class size this upcoming school year. Middle school sports and other activities were also cut. Some residents tonight pushed back on the idea of an operating levy, expressing hesitation about giving the district more money when this district has had financial woes in the recent past, including a former superintendent who pleaded guilty to theft and embezzlement charges after he used school funds for sports tickets, travel, and home improvement projects. But we talked to one mom who said it's time to move on, and she would vote yes for a levy. My youngest will graduate in 2024. So when I process that and think that her, she's had such a strange year already in high school and it's going to continue and it's going to be cuts and she's not going to have a lot of the experiences her older sisters had and others have had and other districts students have, it just makes me sad. Depending on the response they get from these community forums, like the one here tonight, the board will decide whether to put an operating levy on the ballot this upcoming election season. Now, according to the district, when you factor in the savings that homeowners had here in Shakopee and property taxes this past year, the, uh, the operating levy would cost every household less than $100 a year. Reporting live in Shakopee, Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9.